Good afternoon, pro wrestling fans. Thank you for tuning in to another episode here on the Wrestling Talk Show. I have some more WWE 2K15 updates. If you guys want to see more of these guys, all you got to do is smash that subscribe button for more WWE 2K15 news, updates, rumors, because throughout August, there's going to be a lot coming out. So I'm going to bring you all of them. If you want all that, Hit that subscribe button because I will bring you the best out of all this stuff for information. Article is going to be in the description box. Let's get the show going. In addition to revealing these golden WWE memories, you'll finally have a true career mode for your created wrestlers in my career. Now this mode has been lifted from NBA 2K14 and adapted to the WWE environment. WWE 2K15 will feature five times, five times, five times the animation data of WWE game, of the WWE game. Now thankfully, just as much effort has gone into improving the dub the way the game sounds the color commentary in particular and more as well now this is good for the people who have the PlayStation 4 and the people who have the Xbox one games it's not when you get those games the career mode is only gonna be for the Xbox one people and the PS4 people we're not going to have all the people who have the PS3 and the Xbox 360. We're not going to have a career mode. It's only for you guys who have the PS4 and Xbox One. Which I didn't know that 2K wanted to do something like this. But I don't think it's a good idea that 2K would want to go and do something like that. Why? I think what they should do is they should have the career mode for the Xbox One, PS4, Xbox 360, and the PlayStation 3. Not just for two systems, you know, for the newer generation, you know. I don't like that. That kind of bothers me as a WWE video game fan. I know that's just my opinion. I don't want to hear I want to hear your thoughts, guys, on how you, how you feel about that. But but I think it's cool that, you know, 2K is actually doing that, you know. I don't have a problem with it really. I think it's, you know, it's good that they want to have a career mode, you know, for us for uh, for the new generation, you know. But also, guys, the link is going to be an article for this one as well. More, to, there's a lot to come, guys. I'm telling you, there's going to Hulk Hogan is a special edition for the WWE 2K15. Now, when you guys go pre-order this, this is the stuff that you're going to be getting, okay? But it's all, but 2K Games is also releasing a special Hulkamania Collector's Edition of the title for Xbox One and PS4 owners already. So if you guys who have the Xbox One and the PS4, you guys can go and pre-order this Hulkamania Special Edition. And when you guys go pre-order it, this is what you guys are going to get. The exclusive collectible art card autographed by Hulk Hogan himself. You get an exclusive Funko Hollywood Hulk Hogan vinyl figure. You get an exclusive piece of authentic ring cover, cup, canvas, I mean, from Hogan when, on Raw when he appeared on Raw March 10th, 2014 in Memphis, Tennessee. You will get two pre-order launch exclusive characters. You're going to get the character from Hulk Hogan from the 80s and you're going to get the NWO Hulk Hogan. Now it says NWO on the shirt and the bandana so you get the WCW Hulk Hogan which that's really cool. So and you, and you get the yeah so it's going to cost a hundred bucks to get this clutch edition so this is a major update guys here i'm bringing you guys here on wwe 2k15 i want to thank you guys for tuning in to another great show as well and let's get ready for raw tonight but what do you guys think about this whole thing in general i want to hear your thoughts guys i want to see how you feel about this wwe 2k15 wwe 2k15 i'll see you in the next show